everyone, it's me, Patty, and I just wanted to do um, a video of my experience in Las Vegas. This is actually my second time coming here to Las Vegas, and it's it's pretty amazing. I love it. It's fun. Um, honestly, I could say that last time I came, I was 19, and I wasn't really old enough to go to the casinos. And you have to be 21. And now I'm 22. I'll be 23 in June, 14. And um, I don't know, it's just... Um, also another thing, uh, what happened last time my experience was that I took so many pictures, a lot beyond. And I took all these pictures and um, they kind of got deleted by accident. And I was really disappointed. I was like, I wanted to cry really bad, but thank God this second time I will not make that mistake. And I'm going to make sure to save my pictures and not accidentally delete them. It's just the whole process of iTunes can kind of be stupid. Just because sometimes it'll delete everything without you wanting it to. And that's what happened to me. Just so use guys whoever you have iPhones iPods be careful with iTunes because they will delete your music and picture sometimes anyway enough of that and this is gonna be like kind of a weird video um I will kind of do somewhat of a slight mini haul and I will talk about Las Vegas just to not make it oh so boring and um, since I am 22 I'm drinking actually a raspberry -da. Uh, margarita with a twist. It's it's really good. Mm. I I am surprised they have a big one because um the ones I usually get are small, but this one's pretty pretty good. I'm so happy it's pretty big. Mm. It's really good. The flavor is amazing compared to beer. Anyway, um, so just gonna show a little bit things um, that I brought you know travel size it's not I mean I guess it's somewhat of a mini haul just to um, pointers out if you don't want to bring so many stuff uh, you just bring um, small things in your suitcase so um, I brought this naked palette and in the back it has the colors and um, I actually did a haul on this I just haven't uploaded my Christmas haul. I am so late on that. Um, but I will show you guys um, the colors. This is how it looks. This is very convenient, very amazing to take travel size anywhere you want really and you just put it in your purse and it it fits. So um, it, it comes with a mirror course and then these are the colors and they're very very pretty um obviously the colors have different names like venus foxy wos naked 2 faint and crave so it has all these i don't know if these guys can see the colors hopefully but yeah th these are all the colors inside this little small naked palette. I'm so happy I have this. It is an amazing gift that I got from my boyfriend slash fiance. So this is very um, convenient to take travel size like I said. And I also got this at Walgreens. It was not bad at all. It was only two bucks. And it's a, a bow brush mini kit. And um, let's see two dollars not bad at all last minute um you know and it the cute neat thing about this thing is that you um can open it like that it's really neat and then it has like a mirror in in there and you can act and actually see you know yourself it's so amazing how all these palettes and I was thinking about it have mirrors so no matter what you always have a mirror near you <laughs> That's the great advantage. But yeah, it has all these, um, oh sorry, the brushes and it has the, the 
the blush brush, the eyeshadow brush, the sponge applicator, and blending brush, and a lip brush. So I was like, this is very, very convenient too. Um, I also got, um, my mom actually got me this really cute lip gloss. I love it. It's so pretty. I love the color. Uh, I don't know where my mom gets the, but I love all the lipsticks and all the lip glosses she gets. I don't, I don't know. I know a lot of girls aren't a big fan of lip gloss, but I still love it. Well, I don't know. Maybe I'm being too judgmental. Okay, I'm sorry, girls. But yes, I am in love with lip gloss, and obviously, I don't know. P girls call it the matte lipstick, but I, I like calling it matte. I don't know where, but whatever. I love matte lipsticks, too. So I'll show you guys the, um, the way it looks. Oh, I can't see myself, so... Okay, put more on the top of my lips. Sorry, guys. <laughs> okay. And that's how it goes. Lip, lip gloss to me is so much easier to put than lipstick sometimes. But yeah, it's a very pretty, shiny color. I'm hoping you guys like it. Very pretty color. Anyway, yeah, the, this I had to bring some like some kind of lip gloss or lipstick. I obviously have more, but I do a lot of makeup that I've already showed you guys. Um, don't want to really go into detail with my makeup, but um, I also got this travel size um, straight eyeliner. Let me say the pros and the cons about it. If you have thick hair, this thing will take hours. Okay, maybe I'm exaggerating, but it will take a while if you have thick hair. I'm, you would have to go strand by little strand just to straighten your hair. So, if you have thick hair, I mean, I'll recommend it, but not very much. But it was a travel size, little small mini straight eyeliner, and I didn't feel like bringing my big one. And I have... Um, fine to thin hair so thank God it, it worked well but I still took a while straightening my hair but yeah it's it's really it's really nice though it's a really good one it's it's by Revlon and it's a blue obviously you can see the color and it's a really pretty blue color but yeah I I don't know I don't know if I could say I mean I don't recommend it for people with thick hair but I mean if this is the only option I mean if you just want to like straighten your bangs I think it's you know pretty you know great to have but if you want to straighten your whole hair and you have thick hair I don't know if I recommend it anyway oh also another thing I want to show you guys um these cute little bottles are giving out um in Las Vegas and it says Las Vegas here I don't know if you can see but and then it has like this girl but yeah and also what I, I recommend if you know you travel and also let's take a small mini brush also um this is I mean not really related to what I'm talking I know this video is just really random I think it's because the beer is starting to kick in a little and I'm just I don't I don't think I'm making sense but you know let's let's get into my experience when I'm done with this so this is um Oil Moisture with Sunscreen SPF 15, Neutrogena. And uh, my face gets really, really dry. And even my mom recommended me to use a moisturizer for my face. Thank God my face doesn't get oily. I don't know why I got oil free, but it's whatever. You know, Neutrogena is a good brand anyway. So this is very recommendable, especially for used girls who have oily skin. And um, I love it. Like honestly, I never knew that I had to have moisture in order for my um, cover up, my makeup, to look good. I didn't know that you had to have some type of moisturizing, oily skin just so your makeup stays great and it blends well on your face and it doesn't look blotchy because my face is so dry that I would... Um, I would put makeup on and my face just would look really dry, you know? But yeah, anyway, 
enough with that. So I think the beer is really starting to kick in, guys. Sorry. I just really, it's really good. Mm. Remember, you guys, I'm old enough. I'm 22 now. So it's not like I'm 18 drinking beer. Anyway. Um, yeah. So anyway, my experience in Las Vegas, I'm having a really great time um, with my boyfriend. We left my son with his um, grandma, my mom. So it's um, it's pretty relaxing. I feel like me and my boyfriend, we really need a break. So I'm actually having a really great time. And room. Okay, anyway, um, this is the bed. I know it's not done, but yeah. And this is a really nice chair. I'm so sorry about the junk on it, but I love this chair. It makes me think of, like, psychologists. <laughs> like, you know, you know those movies where they have, like, the... Oh, sorry, you guys. The... This, okay. The chairs, and, you know, like, psychologists, they'll, like, ask. I know I have so much junk there. I am so sorry, you guys. This is my little suitcase. Eric's suitcase. Let me turn on the light here. Eric's taking a shower, so yeah. This is a mirror. Hi, guys. Hello. I know. I'm wearing boots. And that's my outfit. Uh huh. And this. And yeah, our room is pretty decent. This is the TV. Forgot to show you guys. But yeah, I love our room. It's re Oh, and the view is beautiful. I should show you guys in the morning. It'll look way much better. And I should totally, like, clean <laughs> the room. You know, people don't really focus on. Um, clean the room in the morning but I don't know if you guys can see oh my god you can see my shadow but um see oh yeah beautiful view you can see outside the view is very beautiful I love the view that we have and um, we're in the 14th floor very beautiful view. I know guys I have to like press onto the you know to the window just to see but yeah very beautiful view Oh god, I've been talking too much. I can't believe this video is going on for 12 minutes. Um, hold on. I wanted to get something. Yeah, okay, sorry guys. Um, this is a magazine and it says Las Vegas. Um, it's like meat. Mm -hmm. And, um,. Ooh, it has a pretty girl with a really nice outfit. I will definitely, definitely, definitely um, have, like, cute outfits that I'm wearing that I, you know, got. But I don't feel like putting them on right now because I'm kind of tired. Oh, look, it's Marilyn Manson. I don't know what he's doing here, but I, I really don't know. I think I'm going to end it there, you guys. So I hope you guys end them all over the place video. I'm sorry, guys. I just try to enjoy Las Vegas as well. and definitely not do the same mistake I did last time where I erased you know my my pictures I don't want that to happen so yeah guys I hope you enjoyed my really weird spontaneous video okay bye bye guys I don't have to mention about Las Vegas um several things um, with my experience of Las Vegas, which I love Las Vegas, thanks to Eric's family, I am in love with Las Vegas. I would never have experienced um, coming to Las Vegas if it wasn't for Eric's family. So I love them and thank them so much. But um, I used to think, like I told Eric, I used to think, I was like, there's strippers in the casinos everywhere. And, um, just everywhere there's just naked girls here and there and and I used to think in the casinos they, they had crazy people everywhere and doing crazy things and it, it's not like that it's not um, it's actually really nice the scenery of Las Vegas is beautiful they have Caesars Palace they have um, the Eiffel Tower of Paris, like, it's just like a little city of different um, places around the world. So the scenery of Las Vegas is 
beyond beautiful. It is amazing. The lights never off in the night. I swear, at night it's like, it's like, it's like night, it's, it's never daytime or nighttime. It is always constantly on the go. You'll go out late at night and if you're a night person like me, you will love it here because there are stores open at night and certain places are open obviously in Las Vegas at night. So the experience is pretty beyond beautiful if you're a night person. And even in the morning they have very great activities for anyone uh, in the morning or nighttime. So obviously things are going to cost, but it is worth, you know, your pay. So, um, yeah, they have so many incredible scenery and I've took in some pictures and I'll try to um, post pictures, but um, that's all I really have to say. I'm not going to go into so much detail, but just kind of my experience of what I think about Las Vegas. I'm in love with Las Vegas. I really love the scenery. It's very beautiful. But yeah, that's all I have for you guys. So comment, like, subscribe, and I hope you guys like my video.